Ben, can you talk us through the, the three uh, mindsets, I suppose, you, you cover in a lot of your work that, that relate back to your mantras, obviously, embrace your weird, own your story and find your mojo? Yeah, no worries. Um, so connection mindset is the first one, and that's about you know, connecting with yourself before you connect with others and, um, and celebrating your imperfections and, and finding that unconditional self-worth. It's not conditional upon you know, what you look like, or what you achieve or don't achieve in your life and so forth. There's no external validation. Um, that's one of the most powerful and courageous journeys that anyone will ever go on, that self-reflection and introspection to work out who you are. Who you are not judged by what you think others expect of you, if you like. Um, the second mindset is purpose mindset, and that's effectively you're just here to show up and make a shitload of money and win, or fundamentally you stand for something, you believe in something, there's something that lights you up, um, and there's a legacy you want to leave the planet. That's probably the highest goal that you can ever achieve for yourself in terms of you know, chapter three of the hero's journey. But purpose mindset also unlocks your goals, yeah, your personal goals, your professional goals, your values. Um, your motivations, your needs. Um, and that's very much answering the second question of, of what do I want? And connection mindset is, is who am I? And then the third and final mindset is performance mindset, which is in the moment of performance, how I can focus my attention on the things I can control and the best version of me and not get distracted by the fear of failure or, or focusing on the results. So, and if you can answer those three questions in those mindsets, you know, who am I, what do I want, and, and how do I get there? You're effectively embracing your weird, which is effectively celebrating your imperfections, owning your story, which is owning your unconditional self-worth and not letting your story be determined by others, and then finding your mojo, which I guess as Joseph Campbell was talking about, which is finding your bliss and going on that life journey and that experiment to, um, to make sense of, of your journey.